The judging is very interesting because a lot of work are based on the insights of the Philippines culture. So far, what I'm looking for are new techniques, new styles and designs. Did the design surprise me that it made me come near it and take a look at it? Was it crafted to death or crafted with love? We're looking at yung craft and design, like not just computer, but going back to the handmade stuff. Concept and execution always goes hand in hand. Creativity is very important. It's a platform, but uh, it has to communicate. I think that's essentially what we're trying to look for. Whether you are designing with a purpose or for good, if you are this, if your design is boring, then people won't pay attention to you. Very impressive, din naman yung entries this year na hindi lang agencies, may mga independents. What I found very interesting are the smaller firms and how good they are, less restrictions on brand, so they're able to really uh, push the envelope a little bit. Well, Adobo Design Awards actually is a good thing because it sort of put the design in a pedestal. There's really no one else that I'm aware of that does it as well as Adobo, I think. Adobo's done a fantastic job of highlighting the local talent and but at the same time putting beside global talent. They're also tapping for me the best design jewelry. I'm sure it will move the Philippines to, to, uh, to be a better design country. I think it's very important for our local designers to have this kind of show so they can um, show what they can do and they can you know, excel, they can like, compete. I want to see more of designers coming out, but designing their own things, like their own products. Not necessarily for, for a brief or for a client. Something more into uh, being nationalistic, whether it be like for tourism or for something to promote the country. A lot of very good fresh talent, and we hope to see more of that, especially from younger graduates and newer people by next year as well. I think there's more authenticity and honesty and really great design when it comes to useful thinking. We may challenge the good mix of advertising and graphic design. So you're not just looking on the design part, parang inside on the advertising. Then. Most of the entries work well. Some of the designs uh, doesn't even need an explanation. Overall, the works are, are superb. So Audible Design is the only design awards in Philippines. So I think it's a very good start. I mean, to have Adobo help this kind of competition every year because that will push the creative, the designer, you know, to come up with, constantly come up with work that's fresh. Yeah, you need that consistent event to keep them pushing, okay? Not just the professional, but the students to look up to the professional, to learn from them. As long as Adobo Design Awards, I think it's a healthy uh, event for the designers especially.